中国有一家汽车大厂在洛杉矶的车展上，强力主打了旗下最新的油电混合车款，来迎合绿能科技还有环保动力的世界潮流。而日本车厂呢，他们也不甘示弱，重新设计包装的修旅车正式登场，让车迷非常惊艳。超大舞台上，三部二零一七售新车款向你不断的招手，外观配上超大 LED 荧光头灯，内部配置更大的涡轮引擎，马力更强之外，新时代 Kia Optima Hybrid 要让你好看。这是 Kia 家族头一位 plug-in 的油电混合车成员，外观追求空气力学的独特设计，零点二四的超低风阻系数，配上 ECO plug-in 字样，当然叶子板上也多出了这个独有的。充电插口。Twenty nine miles on all electric range, which is pretty cool because it's longer than Fusion, it's longer than Prius Prime, it's longer than BMW 330e. We're very, very proud of this. But what's cool about this car is it has this plug right here. You can plug the car in at night. It takes about three hours to recharge. Very, very convenient and efficient. 强调环保车，这台大红色的马自达 CX-5， 二零一七年新时代车款在洛杉矶车展上亮相。不论是外观设计，还是内部人体工学设计和各种先进的设施，都让你爱不释手。CX-5 不但坐稳马自达销售第一名，而且动力省油引擎更是独一无二的亮点。And the EPA just announced last week that for the fourth year in a row. Mazda is the most fuel-efficient brand in the U.S. across its entire lineup, and that is done only with SkyActive technology. We do not have any electric vehicles. We do not have any hybrids. It is purely with our SkyActive gasoline engine. 赶在二零一七年一月，川普上台前，在外美国的汽车市场，韩国起亚、日本马自达，还是各家车厂，都展现了强烈的企图心。在洛杉矶车展，都是精锐进出，就是要抢得市场的先机。喊商机了！东森新闻魏宽，吴中国在洛杉矶的采访报道。